What makes people sick, isn't it? You got any great grandchildren? Uh huh. Think a lot of my grandma. That that she a ma'am. No, ma'am. They passed, and my my um even my parents have passed. <clears throat> but um, you know, uh, uh, as kids we went through some hard times, and it was my grandma that really looked out for us. I hope this this new one will fit right in there. Do, do, do those work back there? Yes, ma'am. Oh, um, I did, but you know, I was working before I ever went to school, so um, I already knew a lot of what they were teaching us. I would guess you were uh, in your 80s. How old are you? 60s. Really? 13 and 68. Huh. Huh. All right. <clears throat> I got. 58 rough end dimensions, 14 and a half. Nope, I got 13 and three quarters. Mm-mm, mm-mm. 14 and a half. I may, I may have to do something else.
I'm gonna have to do a little prep work on this to, um, I'm gonna have to mount it on the outside of the wall. So what I'm gonna do is frame it up with two by fours and um, like I said, mount it to the wall uh, and use these to mount it to the wall. So that's what I'm fixing to do. First of all, my knockouts are on the wrong side. So I'm gonna use a unibit and put in a a Romex connector. All right. Yeah, I need to knock out a, a hole right here. But um, first let's Let's frame this thing up and uh, we'll go from there. is the top. And if I'm not mistaken, uh, that top piece just, I mean the cover piece just kind of hooks on that. Alright, for my sides, let me see.
almost. There we go. Tell you what. So the other one was 13 and a half inches wide and everything I could find was built to fit between 16 inch centers on the studs. So they were 14 and a half. Nothing was gonna fit between those blocks on the wall. Nope, that ain't working. <clears throat> 
I'm going to use tap cons to mount this to the block wall. It is not a finished product. I mean, like it don't have trim and it's not painted, but it's going to be safe and she can have some heat. some long screws to go through I got a there's one of my screw holes there's one of my screw holes there see I can't hardly really see it so I'm gonna loosen this up a little bit and try to get that line up a little better I think we're about ready to go. Yeah, this is gonna look good when it's done. Do I cut them? I keep on, I cut the stems off of them and <laughs> I, I don't like eating the stems on them. Yes, ma'am. You see, I, I got the two by fours around it. This is going to make a little bit of a dust now, but I'll come in and vacuum it up, okay? Mm -hmm. 
Yes, ma'am. Just gotta put that cover on it. I bought it. Oh, they gonna pay me. <laughs> you know that. Does my wife? Um. Well, she'll uh. <laughs> we'll uh. She'll uh. We'll buy them. Yes, ma'am.
All right, now let's see if it, I'm gonna put power to it and see if it'll come on. There you go. You can turn it down and turn it off now. Just the same way as the other one. You just you turn it this way to turn it off and turn it the other way to turn it on. Yes, ma'am. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs>